First meal of the day is my protein oatmeal sludge minus my regular zucchini I usually show you guys. Um, I start stop putting in the zucchini um, because I'm in my surplus now, but it'll be coming back soon because prep starts in four days, I believe. Yeah. Um, that's the first meal today. I want to record a full day of eating for you all today because I've gotten quite a bit of a crush for um, eating like in my surplus. So that's what is on the agenda today. This is my first meal with some coffee, hence the annoying sound in the background. And I'll catch up with you guys next time I eat. Hey, going down the hatch at 9 a.m. Alrighty guys, it is now 11 and I am absolutely starving. Um, I've been like cleaning and doing work. It's really bright in here right now. But um, I'm just like very, very hungry and we're not going to the gym until 1. So still have a little bit and I prefer to eat a meal like 30 minutes before my workout. So I'm just going to have um, two of these rice cakes, um, it'll be like 16 quarts, um, to hold me over until that meal in about two hours. Alright guys, pre-workout meal is two rice cakes with a tablespoon of peanut butter and then one English muffin with some spray butter on there. Um, it is 12.26 right now, so um, after I eat this. I'm going to go head to the gym. I'm going to record the back and biceps workout for you guys. And I'm going to do my first commentary. I got my microphone. And so I'm excited to do that for y'all. So I guess I will talk to you guys there. Alrighty guys. I'm starting on my first commentary. Um, so the first exercise I did here is barbell bent over rows with my Versa grips. That, that's what I was wrapping around my hands. Um because I just have really bad grip strength and I'm just trying to really grow my back. So um, I go ahead and use those for that. Um, then I moved on to the high to low row machine. Um, this is a new machine they just put into our gym and I really, really like it. It's just different stimuli than pull downs and it really helps you to work your lats. Um, and then right here yeah okay so as you can if you look at my hands I'm not I'm trying not to use my thumb at all and so that's gonna eliminate using your bicep as much as possible and just really focusing on your back um, I moved on to alternating dumbbell curls next I do seated here just to prevent myself from swinging at all and if you watch closely you can see that I'm not twisting my arms at all so that's going to help um, just keep the constant tension on your bicep by never letting it twist and rest down. So then I supersetted this with um, bent over rows again, but this time I used these plates. Um, and I really like doing this just because you can't really use your thumb at all. So again, just trying to eliminate the biceps completely and just totally isolate your back. Um, then I moved on to TRX bicep curls. This is totally different than anything I would have ever done until we got these and I finally tried them. Um, but basically the resistance changes by how far you move your body. So these I just try to aim for my forehead going up and then going really slow on the way down. Um, and then I supersetted these with um, TRX rows. 
Again, the same concept, trying to squeeze at the top and then going down as slow as possible. Um, and so these are really, really great for finishers for your workout. And then finally, I finished off the workout with some alternating hammer curls, as you'll see. And um, this is just with 15 pounds, so nothing really much at all. So that's going to conclude the commentary because it's about to end. So I'll talk to you guys in the next clip. So that is my post-workout meal. I had a half scoop of protein, that amazing white chocolate mint protein is so, so yummy. And then a Katie Ann brownie. And probably gonna eat here again soon just cause I'm super hungry. All right guys, so it is 3.21 now. I just got out of the shower. Um, there's pumpkin lying on Jim's six pack bag. Now I'm going to have some of these chips guys i'm literally in love with pop chips like this isn't even my favorite flavor but this is the only flavor they had at sam's and my favorite flavor is the barbecue but i love these so having um two servings which makes this giant bowl full so i'm having some of those um and now I'm probably going to start editing up this video. I'm also going to make another batch of Katie and brownies because I want another one before bed tonight. So I'm going to edit the video and make those brownies. And I'll talk to you all soon. Alrighty guys, looking nice and tired here. Um, it's 8 p.m. I believe right now. I just had that brownie. It actually filled me up quite a bit. And I was super upset because I definitely forgot to put the um, syrup and honey in there. So it was like not as sweet. Like it was still okay to eat, but it wasn't like good. So yeah disappointing because I made a whole batch but I'll have to deal but the good thing about it is it'll be less carbs than normal anyways so that's the last meal or well, snack I'm gonna have before I go to bed um, I'm gonna do some journaling go through the Instagram and then I'm gonna go to bed so that's gonna conclude this video for you guys I hope you enjoyed it Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos. And I love you guys and I will see y'all in the next one.